Today I'm going to tell you the best marketing method to market your models and get the best traffic and most traffic in 2024. In the past, things like TikTok and Reddit were booming. Everyone was seeing big numbers, they were getting millions of views and 400 subs a day minimum, 500, 600, sometimes even a thousand subs a day if it went viral. But now the game's different, it's changing. It's changing how we speak, you know. So TikTok has fucked a lot of people over right now. People are getting banned, it's not like before, they're getting shitty views. That's why you need to always upgrade, always find a new way to market your models. Find the best trending thing. So, with Reddit as well. Reddit used to be very good for people, but now it's fucking up. People are getting banned left, right and centre, they're not getting upvotes. You can still make money with it, but it's not how it used to be, you know. People are still making money with Reddit, same with me, and TikTok, but it's not how it used to be. Now, the best marketing method in 2024 that no one is really talking about is IG Reels. IG Reels alone can make you at least 50k a month. Profit minimum. Do you understand? If you do it right. Today I'm going to tell you guys how I managed to make 30k a week with one model just through Reels on OnlyFans. A lot of people in the coaching program are also seeing a lot of results with Reels. I told them exactly what to do step by step. For some of them, in some cases, I even run the reels for them from the UK market. I see a minimum 500k views every three to four days, 100k minimum on each post. So if you're interested in one-to-one -one coaching, then hit me up in my Telegram, also in my free group. I'll tell you more details. Step one, what you want to do with reels is set up the account, obviously. It's good to buy aged accounts and it's good to age it yourself. It doesn't really make a difference, but if you want to do it quick, quicker, then do the aged account, buy the aged account. There's a lot of places. In my free telegram, we tell you exactly where to get them from. So when you start the account up, if you're in the UK or USA, the biggest markets where you want to push these reels out, then you don't need to use a VPN, just use a SIM and set it up like that. But if you're not from the UK or USA, then you always need to use a, a VPN and with the SIM. So let's say it's a UK SIM, run a UK VPN at all times. If it's a USA SIM, run a USA VPN at all times. Attack from all angles. Make five accounts maximum per phone and have a lot of phones for each model, you know? So with one phone, you can attack the UK market. With one phone, you can attack the USA market. Now, geez, your model has to be hardworking, you know? She can't just be lazy. She can't go like, oh, I'll get it done tomorrow, I'll get it done tomorrow. Fuck that. If you tell her to make a rule, she has to make the rule. Do you understand? You're missing out on cash the more she delays it. So get the rules done. To age the account yourself, what you want to do is get a phone. Preferably iPhone 11 and higher. Get a UK SIM card and use a UK VPN. Connect the VPN to UK at all times. Connect to Hotspot, preferably if you're outside the UK. If you're in the UK, you don't need to connect to Hotspot. So when you age the account, this is what you need to do. Day one of making the account, let it rest for 24 hours. Just let it rest. Let it stay there on the phone. And then the next day, post one picture. And then keep posting one picture a day, SFW, Keep it PG. You can't have nude on there ASAP, you know? Not nude, but you can't have flashy things on there ASAP. So keep it SFW, just cute pictures, you know? High quality, make sure it's high quality with lighting. This is very important. Because when people see the Instagram account, they're gonna go like, yeah, this girl's, she's pretty. And you can see it through the lighting, through the quality. If it's some dungeon and some bullshit potato camera with shitty lighting, then you're not gonna get traction, you know? People aren't gonna realize that there's a girl here. They're not gonna click their account. They're gonna go, like, what the fuck is this? You know, so make sure it's highlight, good lighting. The girl has makeup on. She looks sexy as fuck. Easy as, high, high quality camera as well. So you post one picture a day for seven days to eight days. Doesn't really matter, but make sure it's over seven days. One picture a day. Start, in this process, start following people as well. Follow a lot of people on the explore page, like their pictures, hope for a follow back. If they don't follow you back, then unfollow. This is called the follow unfollow method. It's very useful. People say buy likes and buy um, Instagram followers for the model. Don't do that. Sell a fuck up everything. Make it natural, make it organic. So you have a higher chance of going viral and on the explore page. That's our main goals. Going viral and going on the explore page. Easy as. So when you start posting one picture a day for seven days minimum, you can start adding stories and adding your bio. What we use is Snip Feed. Snip Feed's the best. Um, there's no bullshit like they click it, then they have to go like sensitive content, click it if it's sensitive, this and that bullshit like Linktree. We don't use that. We use Snipfeed. It's the best. Add a picture of her in the background photo to 
profile picture as well. Connect the OnlyFans, say my OnlyFans. Put the link in the slip feed is easy as fuck and it's the most effective at conver uh, conversion rates, you know? Make sure you're following a lot of people in this process as well. Once you follow them, especially girls or anyone really, like their pictures, follow them. If they don't follow you back, then unfollow them. Then you get more followers and more followers while you unfollow the ones that don't follow you back as well. All right, so once the account is aged, now you can start posting the reels. After every reel you post, make sure it's two a day, two reels a day. After every reel you post, follow up with two stories on the Instagram account. Because once you get a reel and it might just get a lot of views, then they're gonna click the story. Don't make this go to waste. You need to make the most out of traffic coming to your account. Always post stories, especially after you post a reel. We do seven to eight stories a day, minimum. Because the more stories, the more engagement, you know? Keep it interesting, it keeps people hooked. They click on their account more, then they see the link. You post a sexy picture on a story, oh my days. He's getting horny, he's gonna subscribe. Do you understand? Now with reels, the type of reels to post, you can either go on TikTok, your girl's TikTok account, and then go on tick save, and then save it without a watermark, and then post it on reels. Um, this works, but the best way that I found works is giving her a branding, giving her a niche, you know? Let's say you want to give her a teacher niche or a cleaner lady niche. Some niche like this, you know? So this branding will make the guys more hooked, you know? It will get them going like, ah, oh, this is a fantasy of mine. Because a lot of people have fantasies of cleaner ladies or fucking teachers, etc. you know? A lot of people have a fantasy of this. Even if it's in the back of their head, they don't know it yet. They'll go like, yeah, this is sexy as fuck. And it's just, it's something out of the ordinary, you know? It's not a bullshit thing that they see all the time. They see something different, they click the account and then they click the story and the snip feed. Voila, it's a fan. Easy fucking as. Two reels a day is a sweet spot. Space them out. Um, post a story every time after you post a reel. Have the best pictures pinned. People want to see them first. And the people will see them first when it's pinned. The best pictures pin them. And guys, this is a numbers game. One will eventually go viral. And you'll see a lot of results. And the snip feed will make it so it's a good conversion rate, you know? But Instagram is very important as a landing page. You get traffic to it through reels. And then they click it. And it has to be on point. Do you understand? You have to get the guy like interested in you, you know, in the model. By looking at your stories, by looking at your pictures, make sure they're sexy, you know. After the seven day period anyway, you're going to be posting more like flashy stuff, you know, more lingerie, more bikini, more strip teasing, etc. You can post these more because then the account will be slightly aged. You normally see in 30 to 40 days if the Reels account is dead or alive. If it's dead and it's still getting shitty views and it's sort of stuck on like 100 views max, then dead that account, don't use it anymore. Set up new accounts and attack again. You have to keep attacking, bro. Always find new reels to send your model. Always make new accounts just in case. Always have backups, you know? And before you know it, you go viral on Instagram and then you'll get a lot of fans in. Easy as. If you like this video, Gs, make sure you subscribe to the channel. Join my free Telegram, it's in the description. It's for completely for free. Gives out you free game. And you can also learn about my coaching and my hose and cash group in there. There's also free guides in the free telegram. So join it, link in the description. Easy as.